What is up, my Funko family? Hope everyone's having a great day. Uh, today was my first day back at work. I'm still in my swag. Hot, sweaty, fat kitty, glossy. <sighs> Went pretty good though, I killed it. Um, I guess I'm gonna do an unboxing now. I just got home. Uh, had a couple of Macari pickups that need to be opened and rated and all that stuff for three days. So I can get to those now. So I figured I'd just do a little mini video-ish. A um, couple things that I was not able to post yet. Um, I posted this on IG, but I wanted to show it off. This is my auction win from Mr. Hashtag Lady for, Hashtag Lady, <laughs> Hashtag Larry, for um, the charity auction they did for AMC. And uh, Hashtag Aiden, so pretty happy with it. This thing is awesome, the glow's sweet. Let's put everything in there. Um, very happy to have this, so thank you Larry and Aiden and Kayla and everybody that participated. Ernie's on the bed watching Wally. -E. My wife just left for work. Ah, crazy. But wanted to show that off again. It's just freaking amazing. Teenage Mutant Ninja Lushin. So yeah. Uh, another thing that came in with the rest of uh, an Amazon box uh, mixture that I wasn't able to show off on a separate video was my PX previews uh, Glow in the Dark Tony Stark Iron Man. Um, I know I said it before, but uh, I was watching a game the other day again, and uh, I cry. I fucking cry. I cry. I'll admit it. I'll admit it. So, really cool pop. Uh, I haven't been able to test the glow yet, but I will. <laughs> oh, Ernie. <laughs> Daddy's filming. <laughs> um, but uh, with that being said, We'll do the uh, Macari pickups first so I can get those out of the way and rate them so they can get paid. I scratch my back. You, sc you scratch my back, I scratch yours. <laughs> Funny because my back is on my... Just kidding. Super bad, anybody? So, this one, if you saw my recent video, I think that's already posted. If not, you'll see it. I don't know. Uh, I was able to obtain the Target exclusive... Uh, Black Panther Glow, which is awesome. I played with that the other night. Sweet. And the guy threw in the small shirt, so Ernie will grow into that. This is the Walmart exclusive. So I think I got all the glows now. This is the Walmart Glow um, Black Panther. So I'll probably do a side-by-side -side with the Target one. Um, show them off and stuff like that. But really cool. Happy to have that. In great shape. Great, really good price. I kind of haggled with the guy as best you can on Mercari. So I got that. So that's done. Um, oh, sorry, I'm gross. <sighs> Second one. This is one that I uh, I got even a better deal, and I used my Mercari uh, twenty dollar gift when you spend fifty, blah blah blah, uh, to get it because I normally wouldn't spend that much for myself on a pop. I just don't do that generally. Yeah, I'll do the whole mystery box thing, but I almost just cut myself wide open oh yeah I did a good job packing packing peanuts filth absolute filth oh, pissing me off I'm gonna rate you a one okay so oh my god they're going everywhere you suck a ball sack <laughs> you're watching your oh pop-ups moving yeah we well, can go see him in a minute okay so from um, my second to favorite season of American Horror Story, which was um, Freak Show. Love it. I finally have, this is so cute. Ah, so cute. Great shape too. We have Elsa Mars with my petite. Friggin' awesome. Um, I have the, I think it was SDCC Twisty with, a, with his mouth open. I just need the other one, and then obviously Freddy as Twisty would be cool one day. Um, but once again, that's Elsa Mars from American Horror Story Freak Show with little Ma Petite there. So, yes! Love this pop. I love when she sings uh, Bowie, Life on Mars in that show. Awesome rendition. Whew. Sorry, I'm just so like, go, go, go. Like I said, I just walked home. Walked home, got home. See? Ah! Uh, this one, Target. Uh, I did not show these off. I was too eager to open them. Um, 
and drop them. <laughs> Back. Uh, these are, which I'm sure everyone's seen by now, but show them off again. These are the Target exclusive Marvel Black Lights, which I played with last night, and they are dope as hell. Iron Man, Doctor Strange, Captain America, and Thor. Uh, in one of my videos, which I think I already posted, I hope, I got uh, I wasn't able to get to a store and I couldn't find it online, so Calvin over at uh, Divine Pops hooked me up with the shirt, not the pop and t-shirt combo, the, the regular shirt. So, that was awesome of him. You guys might be saying, Matt, there's only four there. You're missing Spider-Man. And I was like, what do you think this box is? So. Oh, do not, nope, please don't do that. Thank you. Then go out there, close the door behind you. You can go out there if you want, but close the door behind you, please. Privacy. Oh my God. So. In this box, we have. Think, yeah, go out there and look out the window then. Sorry, guys. Go ahead, but make sure you close the door, please, okay? Un momento. Thank you. You're my world. Gross it, sorry. Boom! Spider Man. Fat kid size. Boom, 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 boom. Pop and tea combo. Bam, bam, bam. I'm gonna open this right now. Please be patient with me. All right. So, you know what? I've never really had a problem with with Target packing. I think they kind of get the whole Funko thing. Um, I'm like Walmart. <laughs> they, they don't get it. So, he is awesome. I cannot wait to see him tonight with the black light. Spider-Man. That is fudging dope. Listen to me censor myself on my channel. Who am I kidding? It's fucking dope. Number 652. That is awesome. Uh, I'm sure this line isn't done. This is probably going to haul. Can... Daredevil. They're probably going to keep going with it. Damn you, Target. But very cool to have that. And then I'm not gonna open up the tea right now. I'm sure you saw in the box what it looks like in the little Spider-Man on the uh, the front there by that booby. Cool, cool beans. Freaking happy to have that. And last one, which really threw me off, I think it's because this it Bam box. Uh, they were so behind on box four, but I don't think this is box five yet with like Tiger King and stuff. I th actually think this is the. Geek Gamer that I just actually started doing because they said they're going to do an autograph pop in every box. So um, I got on that right away and I think they shipped that out right away. And uh, I'm not sure if this has started them with everything being by, you know, off, you know uh, authenticated by Beckett, but we'll see, I guess. So we got black paper on top. I can't remember the themes. Bear with me. But uh, I'll take a little black paper off. And then once again, it says find our insert at the end on bambox.com slash insert because they're having problems right now with the company that usually makes them for them which is understandable um all kinds of stuff okay something opened up because it's i can tell it fell out of a package there's a pop in here so that's cool all right there's a print or an autograph or something right here Beck, um so they haven't started doing the becket yet i can see it says bam authentic but let's see what the print is oh cool that's from black widow Oh, Scarlet. Hello. <laughs> yeah, 1987 out of 2200. Um, fan art collection. Doesn't say the artist. Oh, yeah, doesn't say the artist. But there's a signature down in the corner there. That is from uh, Black Widow. So, really cool. Really sexy. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry to be creepy. It's kind of my deal, guys. Um, leave the pop for last. So, first thing I feel in here is like a jewelry box, but there's nothing in it. So I'm guessing it maybe fell out, so let me kind of feel around for what could be in it. Okay, we have a pin. Oh, man! This is volume five. This isn't the, uh... This isn't the gamer box, which... I don't 
remember there being a pop in this box. Maybe I got one of the upgrades. Because the <laughs> fucking awesome pin is Mr. Joe Exotic himself. Get my fucking mug out of there. That's not focusing. That's awesome. With a little tiger. Yeah, volume 5, box 5. So, this is the pop culture number 5, or geek gamer. I mean, geek box number 5. Um, yeah. Um, let me fill around here some more and find the other... Con uh, I'm guessing this is the contents of that jewelry box. Yep, it is. Oh, okay. This looks like... Oh, I have no idea. It's a piece of jewelry. I guess I'll know at the end. Maybe. Uh, I might not be able to because I'm on my phone and I can't look it up at the same time. Some piece of jewelry. My kid's coming back and hear me yelling. All right, there's the top of the box. Hey, buddy. Come in and close the door. You saw him, cool, cool. All right, uh, you're gonna watch Wally till daddy's done then we'll play around and do something. I I feel one of the little cards in here that they do. Um, fan art card. See what it is. Oh, cool. Marty McFly from uh, Back to the Future. So that is sweet. On an old school little skateboard, little wooden board. That's cool. Um, one uh, sixteen seventy eight. I have twenty five hundred on that one. So once again, Marty McFly, Back to the Future. Sweet. Feel around in here more. Trying to avoid the pop. All right, we have the little BAM match three giveaway card. So let's do that. You can get up on the bed, buddy. Dad is almost done. Let's see if we can match three. First one up. Art print upgrade box. Second one. Art print upgrade box. Third one. Oh, <laughs> PlayStation 4, I didn't want anything. Gotcha. Okay. Um, that's all that's left in the box, just the damn thing. So, I can't remember the themes or anything, but there is a pop here. Let me just grab it, it's wrapped up in bubble wrap. Um, there was, there's not been an autograph in here yet. Nothing else in the box. So. Let's see what we have. I can't remember the other theme. I'm, I'm freaking spacing it. God, this thing is really bubble wrapped. Okay. Dude, oh my god. All right, it's in a protector too, which I think they usually do. There's a bubble wrap. Um, tabs up on it, so that must be the back. All right, let's see what the final theme was and what the pop is, which I'm guessing is autograph, because nothing else has been signed here. Three, two, one. Ninja Turtles. All right, we have a 8-bit Michelangelo. Um, looks like Doug something. Oh, they put the freaking protector in backwards, too. Um... Yeah, uh, that's awesome. I don't know, what, maybe a voice actor? It's definitely not like Kevin Eastman or anything like that. Uh, Doug Spacen. Like I said, my mind's not here. I just got home from work. I hate that crap. But uh, yeah, that's friggin' sweet. Love Michelangelo. And you know what? He goes great with Teen Mutant Ninja Fushin. <laughs> that's sweet. All right, so um, obviously I didn't think about this because now I can't look up the cheat sheet. My computer's not on. I'm a hot mess. Um, yeah, it's been 14 minutes already. Really cool box. Happy about the pickups and everything. Um, I will figure out who this is from uh, and all that jazz. And uh, I guess post on an IG or something like that or try to edit something into the video. I'm not really good with that stuff, but... Uh, thanks, you guys, for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below what you think. Like the video. Mucho apreciado. Don't know how you say it. Uh, but until next time. So just a quick update. Um, I looked up the insert, and uh, Ninja Turtle was a upgrade. It was a level up item. There's no level up card in there, but that's awesome. It was uh, Townsend Coleman. He's the voice actor for Michelangelo. 
uh, on the animated series probably, and they also did the t he was on the Tick, uh, and then the necklace was Arwen's necklace from Lord of the Rings. I'm an idiot, but uh, yeah, those other upgrade items like an upgraded um, pin from Lion King, uh, Lion King, <laughs> Tiger King, <laughs> and then uh, there was an upgraded version of this with the actual hoverboard and stuff like that. So awesome! See ya.